Hi, my name is Brittany Smith, and I will be narrating our video. Tiffany Wooten will be recording. Oh, my name is Ming, and I'm Jessica Vickery. And they will be performing the test today. Stereo acuity is a measure of the smallest difference in depth within a target or between targets that a person can detect. It is a measure of visual threshold involving depth perception. One of the tests used to measure depth perception is the Frisbee stereo test. The test is a four alternative forced choice test in which the patient must choose which box they see the stimulus in. The Frisbee test can be used to measure a person's visual psychophysics because the person has to tell when they see the image in a different plane. Different people can detect different levels of disparity, which is recorded in seconds of arc. The Frisbee stereo test is used to measure stereopsis in a range of 600 to 15 seconds without the need for special glasses. The Frisbee test has three transparent plates that have different thicknesses, which allows each of the plates to present different sizes of disparity, which is how it can measure the stereo acuity of the observer. These plates can be presented at varying distances to change the disparity. In this video, we are going to demonstrate how to perform the Frisbee stereo test. We are going to use the three millimeter thick test plate held at nine different viewing distances. We will do 10 trials for each distance and record the results to determine the person's threshold. We will display the results on a graph and determine the person's disparity. Now Min and Jessica will perform the test. At 15 seconds, you did? Um, the top very good, she got it. Very good, how about now? The bottom right. Very good, she got it. How about now? Uh, the top left. Very good, she got it. <laughs> so now we're going to do it at one meter. The bottom left. Very good, she got it. What now? Uh, the bottom right. Yay. How about this now? The top right. So we would do um, 10 trials at the nine different test distances for that. Um, so after we completed all of the trials, we graphed our results. Oops, sorry. And this is a graph of our results. So we can see that on the x-axis we have the distance in centimeters and on the y-axis we have the percent correct. And the guess rate for this test is going to be 25% since it's four choice with um, four alternatives. So um, taking off the 25%, if we go in between um, what's left, that gives us 62.5%. And if we use this graph at 62.5, my threshold distance was about 365. So um, using that distance, we use the disparity equation to determine how many seconds of arcs that was. So this is the equation that we use to determine the disparity. So this is the equation that converts the threshold test distance to a threshold stereo acuity in arc seconds. Disparity equals a constant times the PD in centimeters times the plate thickness that was used in centimeters divided by a constant multiplied times the test distance in centimeters squared. And the results of our example was with a PD of 60, plate thickness of 3 millimeters, and a threshold test distance of 365. After plugging all of these into the equation, we get a threshold of 1.87 arc seconds. 